Welcome back everybody, as I promised in the last video review of AS Storm um, I'm uh, doing another Transformers Masterpiece review and it's pretty much unboxing video more than a review uh, of a uh, Masterpiece number 2 as you can see it's number 2 MPO2 Soundwave I'm sorry but this box is so big I cannot fit it in in a frame right here so I'm sorry about that and for those of you who follows me on a Facebook uh, facebook.com slash Capico customs uh, you know I scored two of those guys well actually I scored only one another one uh, was scored by my wife uh, so this one particular box is mine and I got it actually I was looking for it like ever since I could uh, find it that well the day it was released I mean I'm sure there was more than uh, enough people mad that couldn't find it not even on a pre-orders then the Toys R Us website screwed up big time because they were uh, switching like three times a day that it's in the stock then it's not that you couldn't order it and pre-order it whatever so after like weeks of looking for it all over the place and going to Toys R Us every day and asking I finally found it on in the internet that it's uh, actually available for order uh, in a Toys R Us in Petersburg here in Florida which is like I don't know maybe 30 minutes drive for me while another Toys R Us is right behind the corner it's like 10 minutes walking distance from my house but they never got it I mean if they well they got it actually they got maybe two pieces but then they were all out and uh, so anyway I got this guy and uh, as you can see it's it comes with five cassettes uh, and for the price I mean you cannot you cannot complain I mean you all know that uh, version from Takara comes with one cassette with laser beak and it does cost I mean the first version that came out cost like hundred and ninety dollars something like that then the second run is about to come out and that's like hundred fifty nine dollars or so and this guy for hundred and nineteen dollars I mean with five cassettes and oh it's it's a great value and I just hope that uh, now it's gonna be turned for some uh, Autobots as a masterpiece is and who I have no idea I mean I was surprised with the first choice of with Acid Storm because I myself don't remember but I read on the internet that Acid Storm actually appeared for only a few seconds in one episode so it's kind of weird choice for uh, Hasbro to release it as a masterpiece I would prefer either Megatron or uh, I don't know some other Decepticon or maybe Autobot as a as uh, 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 another uh, masterpiece they would come up with this one so I'm thinking that next we're gonna see two masterpieces which would be Autobots now what figures we get I have no idea I, there's nothing no words on the internet on the forums and stuff so I'm not sure so well let's get to this guy as you can see nice Decepticon logo right here and uh, the back side okay. back side you can see laser beak busso Decepticon rumble Decepticon frenzy and the ravage and it also comes with uh, energon cube now it would be nice if it was purple but I'm sure that uh, I can find a template online <clears throat> which has a purple or you can order 
the uh, energon cubes which are colored either pink or purple off of the internet they're like $15 for two of them I believe uh, okay so now there's some bio on the side you can see the specs and a info right here now I'm not gonna read it if you want to pause it go ahead okay so uh, let's get to opening now this box is way bigger than the uh, acid storms it's bigger thicker so bear with me please I already cut the tape as so I was just wanted to make sure that everything is in order. So, okay, we got this thing off. Now the top part. Okay. Let me pull it out. Like I said, it's it's a big box. There's a manual. Okay, so there you have a manual which uh, gives you all the info how to transform the cassettes and the sound wave. Very handy. And then there's a figure with cassettes and all the all the uh, accessories so as you can see five cassettes energon cube canon megatron it comes with the megatron very nice okay now I see that there's like so many of those tapes again. Oh my goodness. Ah. I hate those tapes. I just wish they come up with something easier than the tapes. Yeah, well, let me just get the exacto knife. Cut it. One, two. Okay. Let's take the part off, and now you can see. Okay, one cassette they come with nice uh, storage boxes. Kind of miss those things. <laughs> if you can recall that before CDs, that's what we had. And as many of you probably, I was buying the blank tapes and recording stuff from a radio, and it was so funny. Yeah, so this is a laser beak very nice now the size wise there's they're smaller than the regular cassettes than real cassettes uh, real cassettes would be like this big and this wide so it says transformers right here engraved Oh, actually, other way around, I believe. No, oh, yeah, just like this. And then there's a bus saw. You can see very nice. Now, let's pop out 
the Megatron. Now, I don't think that you can... It doesn't look like you can take this part off, I think. It seems like it's made to stay there. So, I wouldn't take it off anyway. I would just leave it on for him to hold. So... Then there's a... Uh, then there's a cannon. Shoulder cannon, which you transform, I believe, like this. Now, I'm not sure, because this is my first uh, sound wave. So, um, I apologize for not correctly uh, opening it as I would open oh, well, Let me look. Actually, I got it right here. Mm, I don't think that it does show it here. Let's see now. Where is the cannon? Oh, right there. Okay, so. Change in. Oh, actually, we got it. Oh, okay, so uh, manual doesn't tell you how to transform it from the uh, cassette player to robot. It only shows you how to transform it from robot to cassette player. Uh -huh. Okay, so, yeah. Well, I'm not sure. Well, so. Uh, I would guess that I do this and then no well uh, I don't know I might use some something to pull it out or something I'm not sure well you get the idea uh, I'm sorry about that I don't know then you have a uh, other cassettes as uh, you know the uh, rumble and a frenzy. This is actually frenzy, and then there's a rumble right here. Come on, fella! Uh, he's playing too hard to get. Very nice. And there's Ravage with his cannons. Very nice. Then you get these add ons for Rumble and Frenzy. And then you get the figure itself. Now the buttons you can push, they're on a springs, uh, actually only those two. Now the fingers, they are actually, the thumbs are fixed and you can only move the in the, oops, oh my goodness, did you see that? It's just pop out okay now it's back on and then there's the remaining fingers all all together so that's that now you see you can it's opening very nicely then you have a shoulder cannon right here Very nice. And the mechanism for a cassettes to push forward and backwards. Now I understand, if I understand correctly, that, well, uh, let me fix it. 
a little bit, a little bit stiff since everything's new. Let's see. Let's take the let's take some cassettes out. Here we have a uh, laser beak cassette, which I can put in. Oh, actually. push it all the way back and you can actually store all the cassettes in a bag here we have a bus saw and the way it is you're supposed to move this level on a bag and then Pop. Oh, now you're gonna play hard to get, huh? Okay, let's see. Uh, I don't know. Okay, there's one. Then you close it. Then you're supposed to move it again. It will push the cassette forward. And yeah, I probably put them upside down. I believe it's supposed to be like this. So or maybe not. Okay, let's see. Let's put them this way with the zeros on top. Let's put them back. Let's do it this way. Now close it. Push the lever. Oh yeah, now one cassette out, close it, push the lever in the back, move the cassette to forward position, and pop another one. Yeah, very nice. Now the head is on a swivel and a ball joint, I believe. Uh, actually, no, it's not a ball joint, it is a only swivel up and down yes up and down then you have a double jointed elbows then the shoulders are on a swivel yes he can touch the button and push the button himself uh, then you have a ties And all the joints that you can possibly use. More joints than you ever need, I believe. Very nice. Very nice indeed. So, like I said uh, in previous video, I'm not gonna do the transformation. I never done transformation on this guy and first time doing it on the uh, video box opening I don't think it would be a good idea it would probably take another 30 minutes for me so I apologize for that as this is oh, just a, a unboxing video pretty much so there you have it a masterpiece zero Two Toys R Us exclusive Soundwave, and uh, just a reminder: I, if you want to follow me on Facebook, it's facebook.com/capicocustoms. I greatly appreciate all the feedback, all the uh, comments, and follow followers. So thank you very much for that. Thank you for all the support and I see you soon. Thank you thank you for watching.